Hi there, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do episode number 19. It's called Glenn's Kids. I was hoping we'd see more family members. We saw Amy's parents, didn't we, recently? So yeah, I was hoping we'd see more. And it looks like we're going to. I'm really hoping Sal doesn't make a, a random appearance in this one. Jesus Christ, we haven't seen him for so long. But yeah, being called Glenn's kids, we know what happened in the office that time, right? When he saw the picture of his family. Oh my goodness. Um, yeah, so hopefully that, none of that goes on. Everyone wash their hands, not just for cacas, but also for wee-wees. And if you need God, help wiping, well, just come see me. Who washes their hand after a wee-wee? <laughs> Marcus! Absolutely. <laughs> I don't want to tell you how to parent, but one of your kids is face. drawing on the back of Mateo's head. What? One of your kids? How many does he have? I don't think I can say in front of the kids. <laughs> Pokemon. and balls. But you have one, but I don't. <laughs> but we both like them. And sometimes they're curved. Stop eating his food! Stop! Jane doesn't even have an authority Stop. over kids. <laughs> I don't think he can hear you. Making the most out of a post-Jeff world. Aww. No. You can't eat the merchandise. I'm going to pray for it. I'll make sure you do. <laughs> Jesus, Dina. Everything around here reminds me of him. Oh my god. <laughs> Did everyone become bald overnight or something? I don't know what was going on from the waist down, but this was a mess. <laughs> You're welcome. Oh, Jeff. You're welcome. You thought Jeff was hot, right? <laughs> the way to avoid that. This straw into my brain oh, oh. Jonah. <laughs> that's pretty good actually that's... then i quit to pursue my true passion <laughs> marking down martin lawrence dvds <laughs> well just don't let my dad see you doing magic yeah he's not a fan of the dark art oh she is one of his kids what the fuck glenn i'm a mom okay that that would be great yeah oh, she's not both <laughs> don't let her put marbles in her mouth don't feed her after midnight <laughs> <Just kidding. laughs> from gremlins <laughs> glenn probably goes by that not, I'll check this out. Kids love me. Hey there, kiddos. kids love me. I'm sure Do you guys like Batman because I think I saw him over in housewares in the movies Even they've I'm sussed him Batman! out Batman! Really? <laughs> All right, never mind. These kids are duds. Duds, did he say? Do you always work so slow? Yeah, <laughs> he's been trolled. I could totally Actually, he's gonna get them to do his work, isn't he? But there's no way he can do this entire display by two. <laughs> he's gonna put his feet up. <laughs> you guys keep doing that, and I'll keep on checking Jeff's Instagram. My dad did something similar to me. It's terrible, but he used to offer me prizes to do stuff like a chocolate bar for like three hours of work when I was really young. Can you make up that? Amy's gonna get jealous. Oh. The woman drinking red wine out of her purse. Yeah, I think she's an alcoholic. No, no, past her, Kirsten and Jonah. Do you think they're flirting? Um, yeah, I, maybe, maybe. Yeah, I'm not bothered. She falls for Mr. B-School dropout over there. Next thing you know, she's ditching classes so she can get all borched up lying her back watching airplanes land. <laughs> Talking about Jonah. Who doesn't fall in love with Jonah? Yeah, we learned that Glenn loves so Jonah. Gorgeous. Oh, God. Hey, Bobby Sue. Bobby Sue? Oh, God. Turn your back for Bobby one Sue? second. Bobby Sue? Bobby Sue? Bobby Sue? Bobby <laughs> Sue? About as much effort you're going to get from Garrett. He's all concerned. Fess up or get out because I was about to take off my pants and eat my lunch. How? What? Is... Why? I lost one of Glenn's <laughs> foster kids. We're looking on the security cameras, but we can't find her. There's a missing child? Oh, Dina's in her element. Happening. <laughs> Here we Al, go. go. Commando mode. We need to lock down access both in and out of every <laughs> entrance. Marcus, out today. Marcus, you're going to need to hold down the button when you talk, buddy. <laughs> Over. You're such an idiot, Marcus. <sighs> Thanks, Dina. Unless she's already dead. Statistically speaking, there's a 30% chance we're already oh, too God. late. <laughs> Why does she eat a lunch with her pants off? I don't want to know. It's probably normal with Dina. Wait, was that the kid? <laughs> Sorry, I was talking there. I think that was the kid, right? She seems cool, right? I mean, like, you know, like, cool, like, <laughs> like it face. wouldn't even be weird if I asked her out, kind of cool. Do you ask him permission? No, I mean, she's the boss's daughter. Mm. I, you dare do that, Jonah, we're through. Kind of felt like we had a connection. 
Yeah, but you're always having connections with people. It's one of the many, many annoying things about you. <laughs> so it's not that you're super jealous and in love with me Ooh. and want me all to yourself. Uh, okay. First of all, I mean, he said in a dirty you. way, but. Second of all, this is strictly <laughs> about Kristen being your boss's daughter. First of all, ill. <laughs> what was the first one again? Ill. You did it to yourself, Turner. I love the way she puts her head right in there, just in case. Abby Sue, where are you? Clear! Clear. Clear. Jesus, you're gonna kill a customer. Candy, the man with wheels has free. Hey, what's up? <laughs> We've all done that, right? I've done that talking to my dog before. See? It says right here, Bobby Sue. That's me. I was talking about a different Bobby Sue. No. Doesn't matter. You said Bobby Sue gets candy. I'm Bobby Sue. <laughs> I understand that phonetically your name is Bobby Sue. I also checked the ovens in cafe. She's either not in there or she's been in there too long. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Dina's mind. Oh, she's <laughs> camouflaged. What's up, big guy? Trying to win the siblings over. I was thinking about maybe asking her out. <laughs> you and my little girl. Ooh, Amy's invested in this. Really? Be because oh. some people thought it might actually be a bad idea. <laughs> Amy's gonna talk him out of it. It's totally appropriate to say no if you want to. No! <laughs> Could she lay it on any thicker, Amy? Not being very subtle about this. I kill myself, and I know exactly how many it's going to it take. Uh, awesome. Great. Okay, cool. What's with the sudden change of mind? <sighs> this is a disaster. Why didn't you just say yeah. no? I can't be the bad guy. The last time I oh. meddled in Kristen's love life, she didn't talk to me for a week. You are so good at being the bad guy. What? <laughs> I'm not the bad what? guy. I'm the fun, good guy. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'll see what I can do. <laughs> good day for Amy. Fun. She's going to love doing this, Amy, isn't she? Okay, I'll just start. Um, it's an awkward bit. So, uh, what she uh, wants. you and... Jonah. Yeah, I, I don't I don't know about that. Oh, is she gonna tell some lies about him? He talks way too much about cheese and you don't want that. <laughs> the last guy I dated stole my jewelry. <laughs> yeah. You're gonna have to help your game here, Amy. Like like he like he has this list of French films that he says he's gonna watch and he never will. She's gonna have to make something up, isn't she? She's gonna right. the cheese and the, the film. Come on. She's gonna do it. And the meth. The this. meth. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he smokes a ton of it. Is that is that a deal breaker? She's doing it for Glenn. And she's really doing it for herself. Now who does the best toddler calls? Oh I god. Oh bird, toddler. Dina. There is free candy in toy department. What the fuck? <laughs> Don't work it. You, you, you try it. Hey baby. Come get this candy. Oh. That was sexual. Ugh. You have a well of the time, meanwhile. Tiny arms are perfect for cleaning. <laughs> oh, God. I mean, not really. Lave labor. So dumb with arms like yours. Careful, there's shit under one of these shelves. You guys aren't friends anymore? Oh, honey. Let me tell you a oh, story honey. about a man named Jeff and why you shouldn't date white guys. Oh, God. With my raging drug addiction, I probably shouldn't mm, be found out. cough syrup. Okay. Um, let me start by saying I did not want to get involved. Glenn fools me. <laughs> He said he was fine with it. Yes, he said that. And then as soon as you walked away, he said he wasn't. He's not going to believe her, is he? He's going to think she's just jealous. Jonah, why would you go mm. down this road? There are plenty of other women. Like me. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> not here, but... Well, there's a limit on those. You know what I mean. <laughs> he definitely knows what she means. We all do, Amy. If you, if you don't want me to date Kristen... <laughs> <laughs> That'll work then. Can, can you, can you <laughs> I can't hear you. Amy told me the truth. Yeah? Well, I, I wouldn't necessarily believe everything Amy says. Oh, is he going to make up a lie about Amy? Maybe she has a crush on you and she's jealous. I mean, it's obvious, right? Does he think that's a lie or is Amy? Are we talking about the same Amy? Oh, no. Know. I'm sorry, I gotta get these squirrels. I got so many squirrels, Jonah. Oh, this is gonna be a nightmare now. Absolute disaster. Thank you. <laughs> it's frightening. <with> you. <laughs> Maybe it needs something like this for them to get together, for them to believe something that isn't true, even though it's true. <laughs> Did you tell Amy to stop me from going out with Jonah? What? No! <laughs> Amy, is that true? Uh huh. Sense made this way worse. 
I don't have a good answer for that. You want to keep working here, Amy? Because you're jealous and you have a crush on me. Glenn! Well, that's what you told me, remember? We're in love with Jonah. You couldn't stop I saying it. I did not say that. I <laughs> never say that. He's lying. She's lying. <laughs> She's a sassy little liar. You have blonde <laughs> hair? Yeah, right. Her whole head's a lie. I made up all of that stuff about Jonah because I am jealous. <laughs> Papa Glenn said. Kamer, shut your cake hole. Glenn is right. I am a sassy little liar and I am very sorry. Jonah must know what she's doing here, surely. You think you know people, huh? <laughs> like you can want something so badly, but you know, sometimes love just isn't enough. <laughs> this is a counseling for Mateo. One time my mom got a new boyfriend and they left me a pet oh, smart. Okay. That puts it into perspective. Only Leo knows what I'm going through. <laughs> <laughs> now technically I found her. It was my trap. Just her <laughs> trap. This one. Let her have it, yes. My trap though. <laughs> Dina will never let anyone have it. No matter I what the situation. Didn't lose her. Okay, <laughs> yeah. bye. Tell you I'm giving Myrtle a ride home later. I, just, I don't want you to fight her. I know you hate seeing me with other women. I didn't press the button. Hold on. He's never I know you were He's never gonna let her for Glenn. Oh, thank God. I mean, no offense, but you. <laughs> he could have really played on that. Like, used it to wind her up. Come in for one, you know, just in case you wind up joining the family. Um, sure. <laughs> Seems wildly premature, but why not? Yeah. Okay. That's it now, Jonah. He's got you down the aisle. Wow, good thing you already look like an elf. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, God. If you hurt her, I will murder you in real life until you're dead. Ah, <laughs> uh, no. No? Mm -mm. That's on me. Oh, God. He's such a fuck up, Marcus, isn't he? Jesus Christ. How's he still working there? Mind you, that store. Um, that was really good. Really good one. I mean, I'm a broken record with this show because they're all good. I've said it a million times. That was really funny. Marcus, again, really funny. Like, he's not. He's, come, he's more and more, actually. Every episode, virtually now, he's in it. So, yeah, more and more. I really just find him funny. I, I don't know what it is about him. But yeah, it's just the actor, I think. Sandra wasn't in it, unfortunately. She's really, she's another one. Really good. Still no Bo. Like, how long has it been now? It's been most of this season. He was in it, I think, at the start. We saw him, yeah, because he claimed was signing the papers for his uh, place, right? Him and Cheyenne. Their place together. So, since then, I think. I don't think we've seen him since then. Which is disappointing, but you know. And that was a really good episode as well. I think that was the episode where he had a fight with the pedo teacher, right? Talking about that, Sal as well. He's He hasn't been in for... Oh, I don't think he's been in at all this season, Sal, has he? I think the last time we saw him was when he was watching Sandra's birth. By the way, I say Sandra. I know that's odd to Americans. Like, if you're American, you're watching probably anywhere else in the world, but from where I'm from, even this country... People from the north in in England and the UK would say Sandra, would they? Yeah, I think they'd say Sa Yeah, they would. Um, I say Sandra. That's how we speak where I'm from. So, yeah, sometimes I will say Sandra though. My parents are both from the north and they would say Sandra. But yeah, Sandra, I would normally say yeah, Sandra. So if that triggers you, I'm sorry. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. But I know sometimes if you mispronounce, well, it's not mis mispronouncing the name at all. But yeah, if it's different to the way you say it or you used to, then yeah, it's, it can be triggering. I know that, but I'm not going to say Sandra, like I have to concentrate to say it. So yeah, even though I might say it sometimes, but yeah, I just love Dina getting straight to the point. Like no punches pulled. Jesus Christ. There's definitely a personality disorder with her. Definitely. There must be. I mean, I'm sure the show is not going to touch on that at all. They're just going to make out that's a character, but no characters like that without having some kind of personality disorder, surely unless they're really mean and I don't think she is so I just think she's lacking something something's something's missing there and something's gone wrong in her childhood I think maybe they're gonna get to that at some point I don't know has she talked about her childhood before I don't think so no I don't think so maybe we're gonna get to find out more about why Dina is the way she is I mean I love her don't get me wrong I absolutely love her but Jesus Christ you know what I mean <laughs> um yeah so really enjoyed it uh yeah there's only I think there's only what was that 19 so there's only three left is there i think it's 20 yeah 22 so three three more 
Um, the next one's called Spring Gleaning. Okay. Oh yeah, Jeff wasn't in this one, so he must. Well, no. They'd split up, so he doesn't have to leave, does he? I was gonna say he must have left. He'll be back, I'm sure. Jeff. I quite like Jeff. He plays. A, I think it needs a character like Jeff. I mean, he was funny in his own right as well, a little bit. But in, he's a bit of a kind of a stabilizing figure in in the store in a way, because they're all so crazy, aren't they? <laughs> but probably it needs someone like Jeff to be in most episodes, actually. But we'll see. We'll see. Yeah, um, really enjoyed it. So hopefully you'll come back and join me for episode number 20. See you then. See ya. Bye.